Want to change your latency mode for streaming and for viewing other streams? In this video, I'm going to show you how. Hey guys, before we get started, my name is Chase and I make streamer support videos. I also stream on twitch.tv slash chasebeyond. Feel free to hit me up anytime with any questions you may have about streaming, whether I'm live in the comments below or in my DMs, and I will do my best to give you a solution. So, what is low latency mode? Low latency mode is a feature that allows you as the broadcaster to reduce your delay between your stream and your viewers. Essentially, this allows you to respond more quickly to your chat. Low latency mode is enabled on most channels by default, but you can choose to turn it off if you're having connection issues or if chat interactivity isn't the focus of your channel. So I'm gonna show you how to toggle this whether you are a viewer of another stream or if you are streaming yourself. So if you're a viewer of another stream and you wanna to toggle low latency mode, what you wanna do is you wanna go down to the settings cogwheel, click on that, go to advanced, and then you will see low latency mode right here. With the check mark, it means it's on, so you can toggle it off or you can toggle it on. Try disabling it to see if it improves view quality if you're having issues viewing a stream, especially if you have a lower end internet. Otherwise, leave it on. Okay, now let's show you how to change your broadcaster latency setting. So what you wanna do is you wanna go up to your profile picture in the upper right, click on creator dashboard. From there on the left, go to the settings cogwheel and hit stream. Now from there, you will see latency mode. There's low latency and normal latency. Choose the one that's best for you. Just be aware if you're live while you change it, you have to restart your stream before the changes go into effect. Now, quick tip. If you wanna see your latency that you currently have on your stream feed, or if you wanna see it on another stream, if you're viewing their stream, go back down to that cogwheel from before, hit advanced, and then click on video stats. Now you will see latency to broadcaster that'll show you your exact latency to the broadcaster or whatever similar if you were streaming and you're seeing your own stream now it'll say what latency mode you're on i've seen anywhere from one to five seconds for low latency mode and for normal latency i've seen even up to 20 seconds now i can actually show you the change if i turn on low latency mode it's currently at about 5.9 if i click low latency mode it immediately goes down to one second. So that's kind of cool if you want to see the difference between the latency modes. Anyway, to sum it all up, low latency mode is a great way to improve interactivity between a streamer and their viewers. But if you have a particular stream that doesn't need it or would be better without it, then you can turn it off. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. Again, feel free to hit me up on twitch.tv slash chase beyond. Come hang out with us anytime, that'd be awesome. And of course, feel free to hit that like, hit that subscribe, Tick that bell, love you, have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you on the next one. Alright, I'm gonna try to jump aboard and sabotage something. I don't know what. I'm, Here they go. I'm gonna do it. Whoa! What the? What? What was that? Holy smokes, that was awesome.